Hey everybody, and this is JTrain997, back with my thoughts on the G.I. Joe Retaliation trailer. Because a lot of you guys have been messaging me and asking me what I thought about the trailer and flattered, honestly. Now, first off, I stand by my opinion on the original Rise of Cobra movie, which is, it's, eh, you know, it's an average movie. I don't hate it, I don't love it. Um, I like it a little less every time I rewatch it. Now, as far as the new trailer, that looks like a completely different movie, and that is definitely a good thing. Um, the ninja action looks incredible. Cobra Commander looks amazing. Um, I mean, just everything about that trailer, with the exception of Bruce Willis. Not that Bruce Willis is a bad actor, but that just... That felt kind of odd with him popping up there. Um, I'm going to need to see a little bit more before I have an opinion on him in the movie. I mean, I like him in other movies. It's just there. I don't understand... I mean, I know he's supposed to be the original Joe. I don't know exactly what they're wanting him, what he's going to function as in the movie. But other than that, um, yeah, I mean, the trailer was... I'm surprised the story is going so close to um, Renegades, to be honest, um, because the Joe's on the run, although we do know that Cobra is established. And is it just me, or do those look like shock troopers raising the flag over the Cobra White House, which is an amazing scene. I love the fact the logo is, bam, right there in the trailer. Um, now, there's a lot of guesses online. There's a lot of people making some wild assumptions. They're like, oh, that looks like the Rattler. It looks like the Rattler. I don't think it's the Rattler. Of course, the plane you see. Um, I mean, there's not a lot to have an opinion on yet. But as far as what I've seen so far, it's A plus in my book. I can't wait to see it. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on right now, and still, once again, a lot of rumors. Um, I'm not like there's little things that I'm still obviously kind of anxious about. Like, you know, is Destro going to be in the movie? Because they set him up right at the end. He was not in the trailer at all. If Cobra Commander's there, I mean, I'm assuming they were in prison in the same place. I would like, I mean, I don't have to have Destro be the center focus, but I'd like for him to be there at least. Um, I think it's going to be hard to get Dreadnoughts in there, or with Zartan being the president. Um, I think the actor actually is coming, who played Zartan originally, is coming back. Don't quote me on that. So I think we're going to see him at least a little. Um, you know, that, and once again, rumors are all over the internet, like Sergeant Slaughter is supposed to have a cameo. Um, right now, there's a lot of rumors that Amazon.com is going to have an exclusive preview four-pack of figures. It's going to have Snake Eyes, Roadblock, um, Storm Shadow, and I've seen some variations. So it's either going to be Cobra Commander or Firefly. How awesome does Firefly look? Ray Stevenson absolutely... I mean, we didn't even get much with him. He's just got that shit-eating grin on his face, and he's like, yeah, like when Cobra Commander looks at him, like, that is exactly what I want. Um, and we got that little scene where he's knocking the rock around, which I like. So, um, yeah, guys, I don't have a lot to say yet. Um, fingers crossed. I think there's his tanks in the movie. Um, the director tweeted a picture of some treads that I think are his tanks. Um, so... You know, so far it looks great, but a lot of really crappy movies have had really good trailers. So um, we just have to keep hoping. Um, he seems like the right guy for the job. Hopefully this will make amends for Rise of Cobra being a subpar movie. And, you know, this will really boot up the franchise, get those figures selling, which will give us more toy lines. And, you know, just get G.I. Joe back in the main center of, you know, people's... Get G.I. Joe back in the forefront of the toy company. Because right now, the toy line's selling well, but it's not, you know... Selling nowhere near, you know, even Marvel Universe, which is a fantastic toy line, but it's not near G.I. Joe, in my opinion. You know, G.I. Joe's near and dear in my heart, and should be in everyone's thing, is it's one of the, you know, it is the original action figure. But enough rambling, um, movie looks good, not a whole lot to have an opinion about, I'll update you guys soon. That being said, this is G, Blech. I was about to say this is G.I. Joe. This is J-Train 997. Hail Cobra!